Hey what's going on AM Gamers, how you guys doing today? This is Jason aka Ancient Myth and you guys are obviously probably coming to this video because you are interested on how to get your external hard drive to work with your console and be able to move all the files over to your external hard drive without leaving a trace on the old one, not copying but actually move it over so you can use it with it and how this works is that Anytime you guys have like a game and everything and you want to play it, you just simply click on the game and play it. It doesn't uh, ask you to move it back, it doesn't ask you, it's not like a copy or anything. Uh, so it will ask you to format it. Go ahead and format it, go to all settings like you're off the side panel, uh, and then you go to systems and you go to basically storage, and here's the storage, it'll allow you to format it in here, along with if it doesn't pop up on the screen at first. Now, it is smart to go ahead and move everything off the internal hard drive to an external because it will speed up your console. That way it frees up some space and whatnot. And you go to My Games and Apps down at the bottom usually. And go to like where it's the games and everything. Like in the queue here is what I have transferring right now to show you guys. Uh, go up to the games and simply hover over one of the games or your section whatever you're going to uh, transfer from like the mine like I said I have three external hard drives uh, one internal so there's four all together uh, you hover over click the three line button or the start menu button whatever you want to call that it used to be called and then go to manage game and then from there you're gonna go ahead and select what you want if you want everything to go over you click the thing that it's coming from and then you go to move all Simply after that you will pick what you want to move it to and I'm going to be moving it to my 5 terabyte as you guys can tell. From there you click move and in just about a second or two you will see it will pop up and it will show that it's moving. After it does that you can actually go through and back out and redo this process till you get all of it. You can move a ton of devices at once as you guys saw before when I was doing it so that way you can simply not have to wait. You could go play a game, you could go watch a movie, whatever you want to do after you have selected everything that you wanted to move over without no trouble at all on waiting back and forth. Uh, it does take a while for everything to move over, especially when you're moving over a large amount of gigabytes of files. And uh, as everyone already knows, there's a ton of games that are masses amount of games and gigabytes. I hope you guys do enjoy the rest of this video. Thank you for watching, and if there's any other questions or if you guys want me to do any other how-to videos, I'll be more than willing to try to get that information for you guys or put it up if I already know about it. Uh, let me know in the comments below and uh, I do appreciate every supporter, every fan. I hope you guys do enjoy my videos. I do let's plays, gameplay, you know, different kind of gameplays and dubstep, you know, creative videos and whatnot. And I also play with the community. Uh, thanks for uh, joining me today and rock on, keep rocking and I will see you later and enjoy the rest of this. Peace. Let's make a run together, I'll be by your side Before we collide And if the sky falls down on you Just beat it up Before we collide Let's make it last forever I'm ready to fly Before we collide And when the sun don't shine on you Just heat it up Before we collide
take a run together I'll be by your side Before we collide And if the sky falls down on you Just beat it up Before we collide When we collide Let's make it last forever I'm ready to fly Before we collide When we collide And when the sun don't shine on you Just beat it up Before we collide 